Hello, and welcome to another wonderful Wired Wednesday. My name is Ashley, and today we're going to talk about the app Words with Friends 2. Words with Friends 2 is an app you can download for a smartphone or a tablet. It works for both Apple and Android. It's a game that's very similar to Scrabble, but it's online. In this game, you can play a multiplayer game. You can either play with someone that you already know if you add them as a friend, or you can play with a random person online. Keep in mind, though, that you don't have to talk to the person, you can just play the game. In the game, you take turns. So just like in regular Scrabble, you go back and forth. However, because you're playing with an opponent that could be from somewhere else, sometimes it might take a bit longer for them to come back and play their turn. But you can actually have multiple games going at the same time. So if something happens where you find that the other person's taking a long time to take their turn, don't worry about that. You can always go online and find another random opponent. Okay, so now we're going to go and download the app. So I am on an Apple iPad, so I will go to the App Store. If you are on an Android device, you're going to go into the Google Play Store. So I'm just going to hit App Store. And then we're just going to go under Search, and we're going to search. So it's Words with Friends 2. And then it's technically Words with Friends 2 Crossword is what they call it. So I'm just going to go over here. So if you just look over, it's the second one here. So I'm going to hit Get. And then it's just going to confirm that. We're going to install it. Okay, so now it's all downloaded. So we're going to hit the open button. And this is just asking if it wants me to send, if they want to send notifications, if I want to allow this. So I'm just going to hit don't allow because I'm good. If you'd like to, you can. So now you have a choice. So you can sign in with Facebook. So you can just like, you can sign up for like a new account. So you can sign in with Facebook or you can sign in with email or you can sign in with Apple. So for me, I'm going to actually sign in with email. And then I'm going to type in my email address. If you're on uh, an Android device, it may ask you if you want to log in with a Google account, which you can do that as well. On my phone, which is Android, it asked me for a Google account if I had one. So I clicked Google account and then hooked it up that way. Um, but you can also do this by email. I'm going to hit next. And then they're just going to ask you here, just make sure you're not a robot. So we're going to find all the images with stairs. It could be anything. Sometimes it's trucks. Sometimes it's lampposts. It could be a bunch of things. Cars. So now I have to go into my email and I have to accept um, this because they want to make sure that I verify my account and do that as well. So I'm going to go in and check my email and I'm just going to verify my account. So I'm just doing this off to the side. You can't see it, but that's what I'm doing just an email they send and it just says verify email address in the email you're going to click that button and then we'll verify it so then you can go into it so now it says your account is verified so i'm going to hit okay here and i'm here so welcome to words with friends so you can start games right away it's giving you some some things to connect with um so like these are just random people once again i don't have any uh friends on here because i'm just joining so you can choose to play with people that are random people if you'd like um you don't have to talk to anybody or anything like that you can just play the game uh and basically um with the notifications too it'll allow you to like um see if you have if it's your turn like if your other opponent has taken their turn and it's your turn it'll pop up and tell you it's your turn um just for this i just don't want a bunch of pop-ups coming up so i'm just going to leave it off but you can start games with three people if you'd like to do that. So you can hit start three games. I'm just going to hit the X here, though, just so I can show you. So I'm just going to skip this step. Okay, so you can see here that I've been invited to start a game with somebody. Um, so this is, once again, it's just a random person who I don't know. But that's okay, because we don't have to talk to them, right? So you're just playing uh, a game against them. So I'm just going to show you down here. Uh, so you can see here that there's the match of the day. So basically, they just kind of... Um, give you match matches like people that um, you could play with so like other people who are beginners or similar skill levels uh, once you get through you'll have like points kind of like you add up and then you'll be able to get into like more advanced people as well and you can do that you can play with advanced advanced people um, you can choose that as well when they're choosing an opponent you can kind of have that as well so if you just go down the page here you can see here that they have like the different points and th point system and things you can um, pay money into this if you'd like to add extra money you don't have to though um, what that is for like extra turns and things or like to ba basically like to, you know, have a, a letter, like exchange more letters, etc. Um, those aren't things that you have to do, but you can just play it for free just as is. So if you come down here, it says play someone new. So you can connect this to your Facebook account if you want. 
Um, you can pick by match and hit play. They'll pick it for you. Um, then they have some other people here that are just pe random people that you can play with. And you just hit play under any of these and it'll start a game with them. So let's just go to, actually, before I do that, I'm going to go down here to the bottom to show you. So we have standings down here. So this is just showing you like your letter board, your total points, your average word score, things like that. So once you actually have, um, have played this for a bit, there's some stuff will come up here and you'll be able to see your standings. Smart match, then you can play with somebody new, so you can hit that and then it'll match you up with somebody as well. Events, you can see here that there's events that are going on. Um, that you can that you can play their challenges so you can you can actually get extra points by doing some of these challenges as well games so these are the games that i have so it's just saying here it's talking about um how this version that i'm on of my ipad uh basically the operating system requires uh, requires them to ask permission to track activity so it's just you get you're going to get ads anyway so it's just personalized ads and that kind of thing um you know help keep it for free and you just hit continue and then you can say, you can, you can ask the app not to track, which I'm just going to hit that so it won't track me and then you're good. All right. So this is games, so these are the games. These are people that you can play. If you have any active games here, you can see that as well. Um, if you wanted a challenge, you can do that. Um, so for example, say I'm going to um, go here and I'm going to play with somebody. So I'm just going to pick a random beginner person. So let's do this here. So you can hit play now. And I can spell a word. So actually, I'm going to spell the word word because that's really funny. I have enough letters for that. So I'm just going to you basically just take your finger and you drag it and you drop it. And just like Scrabble, you have to build a word on the word. So I'm going to say words because I'm going to double what, the double word score. And then hit play. And you said, do you want to send the word words? And I say yes. And there you go. So the, the other person declined to play with me. That's fine. But if they don't decline to play with you, they would just play it. It would be like a game and it would go back and forth. So that's what I've done. So I'm going to hit the X on this now. So what, so what they'll do is they'll find another, we can find another person to play. So you just go to the next game and it'll match me up with somebody else. And then you can just accept the challenge. And then they're going to go first. And then I'm going to go... And I am going to do I will do real. Oops. R E A and then L. Okay, and I'm gonna hit play. So I know it's not a very good word to use, but I'm just gonna use it for the sake of this. So yes. Or and then it'll go back and forth. So once again, we're just waiting for the other person to come in. Um, this is a really fun game. Uh, once again, you just have to be okay with ads because you're going to get them. Um, ads are a thing you're going to get anyways. So you basically just hit the X up top. Some of them you just play through and it'll go through to the next one. Um, you have other options here. You can hit more. You can, uh, go, you can go to the store and you can add extra coins to things. There's a dictionary so you can look up definitions here. So if you want to look up a de definition of a word, um, there's word strength. So it'll tell you how strong your word is. The tile bag, it'll list which letters are remaining in there as well. You can swap and pass when it's your turn um, and that kind of thing as well. And then you can also shuffle your letters around. So I'll just do that like that. I'm just going to hit this back button here. And now we're back here. So this is the store area. And you can see here you can add coins if you'd like to add coins and that kind of thing as well. And then friends, if you have friends, your friends will show up here. So I don't obviously have any friends right now, so they're not showing up here at all. But anyways, this is a fun game to play. You basically have to wait for your opponent to come back and, uh, you know, and take their turn. And it'll pop up and tell you when it's your turn if you allow the settings uh, to do so. And it's just a really great um, Scrabble-like game. And you can play all kinds of people. And it's just a good time. And that's Words with Friends too. Have a great day.